Okay, so in this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to remove the lettering off of shotgun holes. Now, there could be a number of reasons why you'd want to do this. You can usually pick up these skeet holes. They reload very well. I like them. But it's nice to have proper load data on them or color code them like I do. But with a little bit of acetone and a cotton ball, we can take these off, or most of them anyway. The black Remington holes, they don't work so well, but I'll get the cotton ball wet. So here's a Super X slug hole. There we go, she's spotless. Now a Challenger hull. This is a number 8 super handicap. Or I guess first class handicap, whatever. There we go, nice and clean. This is a Winchester Universal. Normally wouldn't bother with these, but so uh, that's my Sharpie marker on there. So it's removing the Sharpie, but it's not really doing much for the lettering. It's about the same as those black ones. It'll come off, but you really got to get in there. Let's go anyway. I just want to show that. These Remington two and three quarter, I don't know what they are. I picked them up at the range today. I assume it's some type of trap load, but anyway. As you can see, really puts a nice shine on them, but doesn't do much for the lettering. Remington Gun Club, come trade off. Winchester Double A. This is the Tracker Black things. There we go, nice and clean. Now the reason I wanted to do this is a friend of mine has a shotgun that's only two and a half inch, and he couldn't find any shells for it, and he asked if I could load some up. So. I'm gonna go through and pick out some of the some of my shells that are a little damaged at the ends. Cut a quarter inch off of them and see if I can recrimp them that way for them. But I wanted to remove that because I didn't want them to say two and three quarter inch. I'll make a little stencil that just like number six and underneath two point five or two and a half inch or something. Anyways, thanks for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more fun stuff.